What's up everybody? Life's Apprentice. Well today is going to be a hot miserable day and uh, the best thing we could possibly be doing today I think as an exterior contractor is white soffit and fascia. So oh, that's what we're going to be doing. I got the house and the garage. The whole thing. Well my phone just rings completely out of control these days and uh, it interrupts me sometimes. But anyways, we're going to be doing soffit and fish on this entire house, garage. We have one day to do it. It's not the hard, hardest job in the world or anything like that, but uh, there's a lot of it. Soffit and fascia, and then we fabricate our own fascia. I don't pre-buy it. I don't, I don't know. Some people might disagree with that, but that's the way I do it most of the time. So we're going to get to getting. It is going to be hot. First piece is messed up, huh? Where? Brand new box, huh? Yeah. Hey, the eye's got an eye, man. I tell you. Look at, and those ones are fine. Yep. Okay. Oh. Oh, we'll return it. Oh, uh, now I remember what you, what you wanted. What he kept talking about from Menard, a ten-inch. Exhausting already. It's hot. Yeah, I think my camera's overheating already. It's like 9 a.m. Uh, but I'm moving along. I got all these windows, all these little stupid bump outs, and it's changing our sizes. And I gotta cut the J's and I'm not whining, but it's taking a little bit of extra time. But uh, almost done with the front. A couple more little bullshit to go around, and then we will be on the side. And the side only has two windows. But it'll be a little bit easier. But it's already hot. I think my camera's overheating. Just about done with this side. This is the uh, most complicated cut up little side. But uh, a little pro tip for you. When it's really, really hot like this, you need to think ahead. Now on a roof you can't do this, but siding, windows, um, soffit, fascia, stuff like that. When you're doing this kind of stuff, you need to start yourself in the shade and try to work your way around the house in the shade. So the sun comes up over there and you can see it's moving this way. So I started on this side because this afternoon this is gonna be full sun. And uh, by about noon, you can see this, this sh uh, side I'm moving to is shady. That side over there is still sunny. So this will be shade when I get here. Hopefully by the time I get to the back, that'll be shade. And then by the time I get over to that side, it will be shade as well. So something that maybe a lot of people don't think about, but I always think about it. Um, I try to think about it the opposite way in the winter. Um, rather than work in the shade in the winter, I try to figure out how to work around the house and stay in the sun. And uh, it makes a big difference. It makes a big difference. I'm sure if you guys have done soffit and siding and stuff like that enough, you run into stuff like this. This is the main power supply coming into the house and going out the roof. But uh, I see people do this wrong all the time. And what I did here, my corner is right here. But what I did is I started right here and I actually worked backwards here. So that ended up right on a seam and I was able to get it nice and tight and get behind there. So that'll eventually get caulked, but just a little tip. All right, well, it's been uh, about four hours. I got one side of the house left to do for soffit, but I've been going around these doors and windows on every side. And this side's actually gonna be straight. And then uh, we can get started on the garage, but the garage has nothing in the way. Then we still gotta bend and install all the fascia. So I had like a day and a half planned here, which I don't think we really need a day and a half, but it's going to be a, kind of a long day to get all done in one day. So I'm going to do a little time lapse here, me doing this side.
she is. I didn't show any of the garage because it's kind of just monotonous compared to the rest of it. But the uh, garage is all done, soffit and fascia. And I mean, the process on the garage is the exact same as the house. But uh, turned out really nice. We're waiting on gutters. We don't do gutters anymore. So I sub those out. But uh, the house turned out really good. The house is really nice and straight, which helps. Especially with your fascia. But all prevent fascia. Um, we'll work on these. I mean, the size was right on these. But uh, we choose to bend our own. That's just the way that we do it. But there it is. Turned out nice. You got some wrinkles. You got a little oil can right here. Gutter will cover a lot of that. But turned out very, very nice. I wish they would have gone with a little bit different color to spice things up, but white on white, eh, whatever. It is what it is. I just hit red. <laughs> anyway, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe. We'll see you tomorrow, uh, most likely, where it's going to be hot again. And uh, be roofing tomorrow.